All right, what's this uh, Frankenstein's monster setup? Um, old uh, rough DNA Phantom 500 triple stage chassis um, modified. This has just been modified to um, for the high voltage power supply only. So. Originally, this um, was a, uh, I don't know if it was a 10 tube or an 8 tube. I'm not going to stick my head in there because this uh, Make OKW OK here is live with this um, DNA Phantom um, chassis powering it. So, it originally had three transformers, and I got a fourth transformer. Um, and no tubes and nothing else in this raggedy chassis. Um, I'm going to probably clean it up, maybe paint it up. Got a couple meters for it later, but I just wanted to uh, get it working since I had the uh, Mako KW mobile out that I converted over to AC-DC. And I had already pla um, planned on using this um, chassis with the extra transformer uh, to power this uh, Mako KW. So we finally got it together and got it working. We haven't tied it up and strapped it down or it did anything like that yet. So anyway, uh, we just did a video on the Make OKW OK ACDC version. And this is just the um, underside of the um, DNA Phantom high voltage power supply for the Mako. Um, Two sets or two capacitor banks of three, uh, I believe, 400 volt cap, 470 UF snap ins, two banks. This um, power supply runs at about 900 volts, and those three 400 volts in series uh, give me uh, 1200 volts from each bank. And um, what's 470 divided by 3? That would be the capacitance of them. About 150, 160, something like that. Each. Since there are two of them. So about 300 UFs. 1200 volts in total capacitance. Um, which is may way more than the original. I think the uh, Phantom or DNA... Um, transformers run a little bit less than the original um, Mako um, power supply or transformer over there I think the Phantom runs at about 900 and uh, volts and I think the uh, Mako ran at about 950 but um, plenty of current I think yeah we're gonna stick a fan in there but for now we just wanted to uh, get it working 10 amp diodes, just one bank, full way bridge. And that's basically all this um, power supply does is provide the um, high voltage up to the chassis here. And then the um, RF deck here does the rest, you know, filament and low voltage transformer there. Um, that's an original transformer, but that didn't come with this uh, DC. Mako KW, um, it ran the filaments and the low voltage right off the 13.8 uh, car DC. So I got that uh, uh, original replacement transformer and put in there so I can run it off AC or DC. This one, I do have the DC power supply, but I don't have uh, anything enough to run it. Maybe that'll come a little bit later. We'll figure something out to run it, but anyway. Got this thing heated up, and I guess you saw the other day um, this AC DC Mako KW on the uh, Mako power supply over there. And now we got it hooked to this um, rigged up Frankenstein um, Phantom um, high voltage power supply only. And we got it tuned up, hopefully, if it didn't move on me. And we're just going to do peak watts. Because I don't like what it's doing on uh, average white. So we're just going to do peak on this one right quick. 2KW peak. 
going into a dummy load I got a 5,000 watt dummy load up there and um, it's keep mud duck radio full watt radio they're not putting a whole lot into it dead keen about 475 remember that's peak not average or RMS audio 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 talking about 1350 might hit 1400 audio audio just about the same as the uh, original Mako um, power supply that we uh, ran on it the other day you know same tube same setup all that just running it off this uh, DNA uh, Phantom Frankenstein power supply as you can hear no hiccups no burps no strings no pains no nothing so anyway hello 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 that's gonna be it for this one maybe later um, I'll put it all back together and clean it up and hit it with a JB12 or something a little modulator and see if I can get 2kW out of this thing I believe I can if I hit it a little bit harder a little bit different but anyway that's it on peak watts for this um, Frankenstein Mako um, KW 3 driving 8 this one does not have the pre driver 2 some of the earlier ones had 1 driving 3 driving 8 but later Mako got rid of that uh, one pre-driver too so that's why I think it can be hit a little bit harder because the ones with the pre-driver would actually hit it harder than you know I'm hitting this one with that little 4 watt radio there um, anyway that's gonna be it for this um, Frankenstein um, Phantom 500 high voltage chassis only driving this um, Mako uh, KW. Bye-bye.